Hi everyone, let us take a complete example on finite automotive string matching algorithm. So the text given to us is A A A B A B A A B A A B A B A A B and pattern given to us is A B uh, sorry A A B A B. So what we do for finite automatic string matching? First we create a transition table and we make a automata from that and if our text uh, given as an input to that automata reaches to a final state we say that pattern is in, in the text right so we'll see that right so to make a transition table the basic step is to create a rough automata for the given pattern so the pattern given to us is something like this so let me create a rough automata so 0 a a b a b right i think this is one two three four and five so just you you don't need to do anything you just have to create a a b a b as a input for the automata now we'll create a transition table you can see more examples of transition table in the videos so what are the inputs we have just two inputs a and b and states are 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 so the basic entries on 0 you are going to 1 by taking input as a so on 0 on, on 0 taking input a you are reaching to 1 from 1 you are uh, going to 2 on taking input A and from 2 you are reaching to 3 on taking input B from 3 you are reaching to 4 on taking input A and from 4 you are reaching to 5 on input B and for 5th we can't say anything right now let's uh, find out the prefix table values for the given function so here at 0 state you have you don't have anything so it will be 0 at 1 you have a so you will write a and you have to fill position for b so you will add b to it and you will find the prefix value which is 0 right a doesn't matches with b correct to know how to find the prefix value you can check previous videos uh, now here at state 2 you have a a right and you have to fill this a so if you check the prefix value for this a matches with a a a matches with a a right so it's two correct then for three if you are you have reached here and uh, let me change the color and here you have a a b right you are here right so a a b has been covered and uh, you need to fill this position that is b so if you check the value a doesn't matches with b and uh, a a doesn't matches with b b and uh, a a b doesn't matches with b b so it's zero right and for fourth one if you check you are here you have reached a a b a and you have to fill this position that is a so a matches with a, a a matches with a a, a a b doesn't matches with b a a, a a b a doesn't matches with this. So two, right? Now here you don't have anything and you have reached here. So a a b a b a a b a b. Am I right? And you have to take for this and this. That is for a and for b. So let's take a a b a b a. And then we'll take A, A, B, A, B, B. So if you check here, A matches with A, A, A doesn't match with B, A, A, B doesn't match with A, B, and I think nothing will match, only one. So if you check here, uh, A matches with B, no. A, A matches with B, B, no. A, A, B matches with A, B. Huh, here if you see A, A, B, A, B, B. A, A, B doesn't matches with A, A, B. No, I thought it is A, A, B. So, 0. Yeah. So, it's 1 and 0. Right? So, you are done with the transition table. Means half of the question is already done. Now, you just have to create a 
automata out of it and have to pass input as a text to that automata right so if you want you can draw a new automata or you can just add edit in the previous one let me draw a new one for you so you have 0 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 is the final state right and I'll just change the color for timing for 0 taking input a you are reaching to 1 and on taking b you are at 0 only and from 1 taking input as a you are reaching to 2 and on taking the input b you are reaching to state 0 from 2 you are at 2 only on a and you are going to for b and for third one if you see it's going to 4 on a and on 0 on b and from 4 you are reaching to state 2 and you are reaching to the final state on sorry this is a sorry and this is on 4 from a you are reaching to 2 and from b you are reaching here and from final on taking input you are reaching to 1 on a and reaching here on taking input b right so this is your automata now you have to traverse the string or you have to put uh, give a input as your string so your text string was a a a b a b a a b a a b a b a a b so let's trace this so we will start with the zero right then uh, you will take a you will go to one then you will again take two a you will go to two then again a you will again be in two then b you will reach to three then a you will reach to four then b you will reach to five see you have reached to a final state here so you can say that you already have traversed or you can say a pattern is found in a text because you have reached to a final position but for timing i'm just uh, writing the complete execution so you have otherwise you have already got it right you are here now 5 is a final state and you are already at the final state means this pattern is there in a string and you can see this a a b a b was the pattern right but i am traversing the complete uh, text for you so we were at 5 then again at a you will go to 1 at again 2 then from B as an input you will go 3, from 3 taking as A you will go to 4 and from the 2. So this is a sequence of state traversed. Sequence of state. Sometimes question in question they are sequence of states. That's why I traversed a complete state. Right? So this is how we do finite automata string matching. Thank you.